Tommy, you asked some really funny questions. Did you enjoy it? It was really fun, but are you very strange questions? Good morning, everyone. So this morning I've awoken and I've got a lot of energy and I've just decided to turn my camera on. I've been a lunatic, I've just turned it on and uh, I just thought I'd say hello. I just want to be productive, I've got lots of energy and I just thought I want my channel to just be sort of chilled, be able to talk, you know, do little bits and bobs, nothing too strenuous. You know, we did a pretty crazy vlog last time, we went on a run together, we ate fish and things like that. So I don't want it to always be mental, I just want it to be, be able to have like a chat. So this morning I've awoken, I've been for a 5k run, uh, I've released some good endorphins, I'm feeling good. What have you done today? But I'm in the apartment, I've not really got much on. I'm going to send a few emails. Um, I'm not really, I've never really sent an email in my life. That was just to sound intellectual. And then I'm probably going to go for a little gym session. And I've got a friend coming over later. Um, so I've got a few nice little bits and bobs. So again, if you want to come, just watch, watch, and just enjoy each other, enjoy my company. But um, what I did want to say is uh, thank you very much for the love. Uh, on Bromans, like it's wonderful. Everyone on Twitter, I'm getting a lot of tweets off my bottom. Um, I mean, it's lovely getting the support and stuff. I mean, any any love's good love, so yeah, thank you for the support, whether it be of my bum or me or Rhiannon, it's all very lovely. And also, thank you for the support of my day in the life vlog. It was only quite a simple thing, um, but everyone was really lovely about that as well. Everyone's just lovely, just thank you for being nice. Um, and you guys said I didn't sound like too much of an idiot, so that's always good. I'm gonna go and cook some chicken now, if you wanna come with me. Uh, if not, you can stay in the living room and chill out. Let's go. Um, so I'm gonna have some post-running fuel, some food. I've got some boiled chicken breasts, which I know look ghastly, wholemeal noodles, and some green beans. So right, so I've literally cut it all up, frozen beans. Get them ones, because normally I buy fresh beans, but then they just rot. So get the frozen ones and you can keep them for 27 years if you fancy. Get it in, stir it together. Get that going. Service! Can I get service? No worry. Ooh, this took about, honestly, about three minutes. So beat that, Mr. Lean in 15 minutes. So post run nutrition, really healthy. I've got my greens, I've got some wholemeal noodles, and I've got chicken breast. Really simple, eat it. Look, I'm not gonna bore you now with you watching me eat this, um, as sexy as it may look. So I'm gonna chow down, I'm gonna go to the gym, uh, then I've got a few friends coming on later, so just keep watching and you can just pop in and out of my uh, of my day and just see what I get up to. Anyway, so thanks for joining me this morning. I've, I've again loved your company. Ciao. Guten Tag. Hello there. I, uh, I rejoin you after my very productive day. Um, oh, I went and played, I went and played uh, some golf. I went and played nine holes of golf, which is nice. Breathing the fresh Surrey air. And I put my foot in a swamp. There's a video online, so that could be quite funny to watch. And then the two boys around here, we've got Jimmy Lang. And we've got Will Haig Blundy. You haven't met Blundy yet. Well, say hello then. Hello. Hi, I'm Will. Lovely. So basically, I thought I wanted to make this evening a bit more fun because those two are very boring. Um, what we're going to do, I've got my mother Sally coming round uh, and we're going to do a bit of a fun questionnaire. Yeah, keep watching. She'll be round in about four minutes. Get in here, Sal. What are you doing, Tom? Yeah. What are you doing? Come on in. So we've come up with an idea. Say hello to everyone. Hi, uh, good Will, you've lost so much weight. He's a skinny prick, isn't he? Maybe I'm a little bit like James. Thank you. Well, what are you doing, Tom? Right, we're not here to socialise, we've got a bit of a game that we're going to do, and you're going to feature because we think you're funny, okay? No, but I don't want to do a game. Yeah, you're doing one. How come it's so tidy in here? Because you've come round. Also, you need, to do more, you, you need to do more washing as well when this is done. I know, I Should I put the washing tidy. on now? No, no, I The good thing about old Sal is that she lives uh, far enough away so that we can party and James can bring strippers Hey, that's nice, Tom. <laughs> <laughs> Mum lives far enough that away so... Time. Stop! James can bring strippers around, however, she's close enough so that she can come around and do all of our washing. So, I know that's really bad, but 
You're not not gonna get your washing done, are you? I'm not like a scuttle through. <laughs> You've only got a 10 minute slot in here, so get the washing in and out swiftly. I'm gonna be in and out quickly. I'm gonna be doing a dark wash. Good. So obviously I'm going to be sorting through the Tom, you've got your bloody belt in here again. But what you if that. you have something? Belt off. What if belt. you have... Belt off. You were, Oh, what are you doing, Sam? No! <laughs> anyway, so we've got a bit of a game. We're going to get set things up. We're going to ask Mother some questions, and it's going to be fantastic. I feel like I just had are you excited? I'm actually, I'm so excited. Good enthusiasm, Sally. Everybody, this is Sally, my amazing mother. She's been my mother for 22 years now. Say hello. Hello everybody, I'm Tom's mum. Leave the blinds. Please. Leave the blinds. Leave the no, blinds. No, 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 no. And we're going to answer every question as well as you can. So, good okay, posture. Yeah. Snog, marry or avoid. Okay? Number one, we've got Boris Johnson. Number two, we've got Donald Trump. Or, we've got Kim Jong Jong Yun. And may I mention, Kim Jong Yun has a massive missile as well. So you've got to marry one, you've got to snog one, and you've got to avoid one. Oh, Tom, that's so complicated. I would suggest marry the first one. Boris. Yeah. Why? I think he's nice. I really like Boris. I like his hair. Yeah. Yeah, and he's a nice man. Uh, so you're going to sort of do what to him? Marry him? Yeah. Snog. You're left with Kim Trumpy. Jong-un. You're going to snog Trump. Trumpy, yeah. Avoid the missile. Okay, yeah? good. Yeah, good. How would you advise Theresa May to negotiate a hard and swift Brexit? I would just say to have a good breakfast and then really think about what the country deserves. Listen to that, Teresa! She's told you! Number four. Have you ever smoked weed? God, no. Really? No! Good girl. Uh, number five. Has there been a serious decline in quality of Bake Off now Mary Berry has left? Well, I haven't actually watched it, but I'm led to believe that they're actually sort of rallying around and it's much the same as it was. And I think obviously Mary Berry is like sort of like the pioneer. Yeah. But I think they're sort of, yeah, I think they're keeping up the... You think it's, it's, yeah, maintaining, I think it's the good... maintaining good standards, yeah? Okay, good. Right, we're doing very well. We're nearly there. You're doing really, really well. How do you feel? Really, really relaxed and sort of quite I don't fine. know if you can notice, but if, make sure you leave some nice comments because Sally's put her red lipstick on specifically for this interview. And I've just been working 12 hours. And she's center. single and looking for a man um, that, you know, could potentially take her out for a nice dinner. Um, or two. Obviously, you know Liam, the big guy from Bromans. Obviously yeah. you think he's a massive pussy after a beat him up. What are your thoughts on that? I think he should probably be the next one to go. Oh no, he has, he's already been kicked off. I know, I know, I know, but I think he should have been, yeah, so... Yeah, did you expect me to beat him? No, I was like really shocked, it was horrendous, I couldn't breathe. Poppy and I took, couldn't breathe throughout the whole fight. But then you didn't doubt me either? Oh god, no. What's your favourite non-pornographic magazine to masturbate to? Tom, I don't really want to discuss this, like, especially... You said like, you'd give energy! Just yeah, like... I'm not going to do it with Jimbo here, am I? And Will? <laughs> I mean, Will's looking like dodgy with those glasses on. What's your favourite? No. One doesn't. You can pass if you like. I'm going to pass. She's passed. Hey, here's a scenario for you. You just need to be honest. You've stepped in at fly half, you're 40 yards out, there's a blitz defence and the blind side winger is up. What are you going to do? Um, probably sit down. That's something like James Lang would do. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay, this is the, the good question here. So, you've got six children. One has. Seven different dads. No! no. I'm, joking. <laughs> I'm joking, you've got six children, okay? Two different dads. It's been a hard upbringing and I don't know my own dad now. You do. <laughs> but we'll yeah. get into it. Anyway, six children. Here's a scenario for you, you've just got to play with it, okay? Mm -hmm. Donald Trump has blown up the rest of the world, but has left China. We've booked a flight with Ryanair, but unfortunately, due to a lack of pilots, we've had to get a replacement bus service to Beijing. Anyhow, we've touched down in China, okay? We're in China. Yeah. Uh, and I've got a bit of a hard one for you. Due to the one-child policy rule, you have to slaughter five of your own children. Oh, Tom, I no! can never do that! Leaving you with the one and only golden child. And obviously, seeing my fighting prowess on Bromans, you can't leave it to what like last man standing, because I will knock Poppy out. Yeah, and I'll swing Poppy. for Fran. Okay, so I'll have them all. I've got Who my gonna... Andy and Edward and Laura, and she's got she's a mother of two. You've got to murder five of them. Who's going to remain? How am I going to be doing the murdering? Well, we can talk about that as well. But I need I the don't remaining. Think, I, I need the remaining I'm, child. I think I'm going to have to pass on that, darling. 
I think you've been a bit soft there. I'm probably the golden child. Poppy is a shithead, and I'm just nice. So this is like a sort of like a sort of a, a scenario. Yeah, and I need you to be honest and answer it. Yeah, but I'm gonna then sort of not be terribly popular with the rest of the five of them, am I? And if it's me, fun. nod. You're gonna save. Well, I would like to think I would save you, darling, but I mean. I'm well, the end of it. I've saved it. Piss off, Poppy. Um, no, but like anyway, that's been the mother and son questionnaire. Sally, you did amazingly. Then, Tom, you asked some really funny questions. Did you enjoy it? It was really fun, but are you very strange questions? I would rather have questions on midwifery. Okay. Or like cooking, <clears throat> or like. Washing. Mary Berry was involved. No, I don't see what she was I think slaughtering the children was a bit. Um, a bit. <laughs> Maybe we could have left them behind, and they could have got deported back. Um, <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> slaughtering <laughs> is pretty extreme. Yeah. I don't I think they yeah. would have, they would say on the spot as well, like kill them now. Yeah. Probably, like, they, they probably said they can't come in. Yeah. Right. Okay. She's like probably feeling a bit depressed. Right. And I think we're going to finish it here. Then we're going to finish the vlog. I think it'd be good. So say thanks for having me. Thanks for having me. It says. Oh Kim. oh Kim! So that's the that's the questionnaire done. Mum was a bit nervous, but it was just a bit of fun. Um, I've had a lovely day today. I just want to keep doing these little vlogs. I want to keep the videos coming. Leave a comment and let me know any ideas of the videos that I should do because I haven't got like a specific niche. I'm just doing a day in the life of Tom all the time. So um, if you've got any cool ideas, let me know. Anyway, thanks for watching and thank you for the support. As I said at the start of the video, you're all really lovely. Um, I'm going to go to sleep now because I've got a rugby match tomorrow. Lots of love. Stay golden. Just subscribe. Would you?